Welcome back guys to another episode of my Victoria Lazy Bastard. Let's play. Uh yeah, so last time we also did some yeah, some defense work down down the south here. Um yeah, we were also researching a bit of stuff. That actually looks uh, pretty good over here now. Yeah, we are getting in uh, quite a few more green circuits. Oh yeah, right, we also doubled our, our copper production, so... That's probably why all of this uh, looks so freaking good. Uh, I, I think we could uh, easily go ahead and uh, double this thing uh, right now, actually. But before we are doing that, I really want to, to upgrade these here to the better power poles. Okay. Wait, yeah, this doesn't work. Oh, freaking K. Okay, so now, basically all we have to do is make this uh, ready for getting blueprinted. Okay, well that looks Sweet, so now let me just grab a copy real quick and just paste her like that. I obviously forgot this right here, but that's not a big deal. And there are the construction bots on the way. Okay, there comes the belts. There comes the power poles, and now we have even more cover production, uh, green circuit production, I mean. Yeah, we should also upgrade uh, at least that uh, section right here. So everything can flow a little bit faster. Okay, so we also don't have the the most iron up here. We could really take some some more iron up there. Uh, yeah. How do I want to do this? Actually, let me uh, start by upgrading all of this crap here. All the way to here, so I think maybe when we uh, cut this away, we should already get a bit more iron up there. I don't think that this uh, thing here is really necessary. Then we also have to upgrade these guys. Okay. Now they should get a lot more iron up there, and also copper seems pretty pretty okay here. So let me look at the production graph. Uh, yeah, well, but it takes some time to adjust, probably. Uh, yeah, but the, the output here down here looks actually pretty sweet. Now we could also try to get more... more of these... Uh, of the red circuits. But I'm not too sure about that. I think they are actually good enough as of right now. But yeah, all of our research is uh, also looking pretty good. We could theoretically fit in some, some more labs even. Do we have labs in our thing? Yeah, we actually do have labs in our uh, thing. So we could even do that. Again, I want you to redo all the power poles. Yeah, we actually need them on both sides. I mean, here it wouldn't make a big difference, but I really want to yeah, use only the, uh, the cool ones. Yeah, lab research speed, why not? So 
So it looks like we finally have uh, pretty much enough resources again, which is pretty sweet. So let me just uh, make 10 more. Boop. Just like that. That's just really beautiful. Yeah, actually, let's also... Could go... Yeah, let's go all the way to here. Yeah, we will have to redo this anyways at some point. Yeah, now it needs to craft more of the labs, but that's also not a big deal. Yeah, so now we are running in, uh, in power problems again. Yeah, we could do nuclear again, but uh, all uranium is kind of far away from us. I would want to go for solar, but I don't really think that we have anywhere near enough. Uh, green circuits for that because that's really really expensive so we probably have to to do more steam again so now the question is how are we going to do that uh yeah maybe we should set up some production for all the steam stuff that we need Oh yeah, that's like a bit of an issue. Why do I have a logistic bot on me? Oh yeah, we can make the person robot, by the way. But yeah. Oh uh, yeah, we would need uh, pipes and stuff for the, the, all of that. And that's all a little bit problematic. We also... Yeah, let me just uh, craft of stuff here by by hand basically okay let's start with the uh with the boilers okay yeah that goes actually pretty quickly and let's also do some here Let's wait for the pipe delivery. Yeah, we definitely do need more pipes, that's for sure. Yeah, that wasn't too many pipes, but uh, yeah. Oh uh, yeah, let's just do more, please. Ah. Uh, Yeah, because then we can just uh, blueprint it, basically. Yeah, this takes quite a few pipes. Yeah, let me see. I think we should have pipes uh, also over here somewhere. But not really in uh, big quantities. Yeah, no, that's basically nothing. Yeah, they are also level 2 assembly machines, so this isn't going to get any faster here. So, yeah, we just have to deal with it, kind of. Yeah, we're getting a couple of attacks here, but they are not really problematic, I think. Okay, so now we're done with that at least. Yeah, f we would need like 166 boilers. We have 22. Yeah, I also need some gears. 
You could say that it really uh, grinds my gears, huh? Okay, yeah, but this should uh, maybe be even fine for at least something. Yeah, the question just is uh, where we want to, to build it. So we would need uh, another row port right over here. I would want you to, to build this uh, over here somewhere. So let me just uh, remove trees here a little bit. I mean, they are all looking pretty dead anyway. Or are they? Yeah, well, they are <laughs> directly in the middle of heavy pollution here, but uh, yeah. yeah. You can really see how the desert just doesn't uh, eat away the pollution as much as the grassland over here does. Pretty interesting. Yeah, we are definitely going to touch some of these up there. Oh, we are already done. Cool. So, uh, let's start. Yeah, let's just take um, this down here. Well, I would want to upgrade this to medium power poles here as well. What? Since when can you walk between the boilers here? Doesn't even make any sense, but hey, you can. Yeah, I don't really. Let's just uh, do it. So that's uh six. So you would need. We would need like two of uh, two of those basically I think um yeah so let's throw that right in here and right in here so now we have one two three four five six seven eight nine 10, 11, 12. Oh, yeah, I kind of see a problem here. Yeah, let's see if that actually works because now we have, we don't have like the, the one space in here in the middle. So yeah, let's hook that up right here. Let's also hook in the coal. I need more of those power poles right here, but I can happily supply them. Uh, yeah, we will need more and more coal though, probably as well. Yeah, we should probably get something. We also need more, more uh, boilers and more steam engines. Yeah, that's all a little bit problematic. Okay. Yeah, so let's see. Now that all is there, which is sweet. We also need two offshore pumps. Uh, 
that, so read circuits for that, so, okay. So now we should be able to do all of that. I think about maybe producing some solid fuel for now. Maybe that would uh, help. Okay, yeah, we get the we have the problem that I thought it would get now. That's quite unfortunate. So let me just uh blueprint that side here. And then we have to tear it away. Yeah. It hurts a little, but it's uh, necessary. Yes, now you can fit in like that. Which should like actually work pretty well. So yeah, some pipes here as well, obviously. And then uh, this should all uh, pretty much work. Okay, yeah, I already saw the alien there. And I already thought about maybe putting also down some uh, some defense. Which would also make uh, sense, I think. Okay, you need to be hooked in as well. Probably you down here as well. So let me get uh, some laser turrets to just augment the defense up there. Oh yeah, that's uh, pretty much uh, sticking back here. Wow, that's cool. Maybe we should actually start doing some uh, some solar panels. Okay. Oh, I think we can also make the uh, the level two battery now. If we have an assembly machine, which we now have. Yeah, then I could use the solar panels for now to just uh, also put into my power armor. Let me actually look here. So this thing takes 20 megajoules and this 100. So basically, yeah, basically I have now the, the same amount of energy storage. But just with uh, one battery instead of five. Okay, so now we have uh, even more space for stuff, which is pretty cool. So tons of solar panels, for example. Okay. So let me just uh, walk over and put down my laser turrets. And then we can end the, the episode pretty much again. All right, so our electricity now looks pretty, pretty dope. But yeah, our coal supply just gets literally eaten away. Let me also look at my coal production graph here. I mean, we are probably pretty mu much at maximum right now, which definitely is very likely not very healthy. Yeah, also these guys up here are definitely not getting enough coal. 
Okay, this guy here also has its first kills already. Yeah, there's tons of pollution again here. But that's stuff that we have to figure out in the next episode. So thank you for watching. See you all then. Have a great time. Bye-bye.